access the effusion in the other. So I'm going to put a bit of local and setting in. We're now going to put two outside and suture, and we're going to secure the, the chest drain. Frame spears get the foot in the animal. Throwing a piece of wood, the nail in the piece of wood has gone through. And sustained a fracture dislocation to her right ankle. Um, she has got pedal pulses at the moment, but the ankle is deformed, and we need to reduce that quite quickly. Now, to do this, we're going to provide analgesia and sedate this lady. So we've taken a brief history and also noted when she's last eaten and drunk. And we have full monitoring on board and oxygen. So we're monitoring our heart rate, oxygen sats and blood pressure. I've also got two people assisting me. One person just to concentrate on the patient while she's sedated and another person just to help with the uh, reduction of the ankle. And you can see here the ankle has sort of been laterally displaced and this is the sort of medial malleolus with a lot of swelling and bruising around it there. So we're just going to provide some analgesia with morphine, titrate that to her pain and then provide some sedation and then get on and reduce the ankle. Okay, we've now given this lady five milligrams of morphine for a pain, reassessed her blood pressure, her respiratory rate, and looked at her pupils. Um, and we're now going to sedate her using midazolam, a short-acting benzodiazepine. And to start with, we're just going to give her two milligrams and see how that works. And then we can titrate this up in one milligram doses. Okay. So what, what we're now going to do is reduce the, the fracture dislocation of the ankle. Um, and it's very important with injuries like this that we don't x-ray them first because that can waste time and allow the ankle to become more swollen and, and compromise the, the blood supply to the foot. So essentially what we're going to do is apply traction first of all. And I've got Natalie, my assistant, to help me with that. Um, and then initially we're going to exaggerate the injury and then relocate the, the um, foot into the ankle mortis. <laughs> I'm just going to sit her on the table. Yeah. I'm just going to sit on the table. 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 Grasping the, yeah, the heel with my right hand and just applying traction to start with. Okay, and just actually with simple traction there, it's, it's gone back here. And I'm just checking the, the foot pulses now just to make sure we've not just caused any further damage. And there, there are excellent foot pulses there with good capillary refill in the, the toes. Two seconds. Now we're now Tana is now plastering the foot, and what we're aiming to do is get the foot in the, the anatomical position, i.e. Right, sort of 90 degrees to the uh, lower leg. And it's just very important now just to try and mould the plaster to the shape of the, the lower leg and foot to try and hold the, the foot in the anatomical position. Yeah. 